yeah, brother. You're on the Please Me Fall on YouTube channel. All right, guys. We just ran a little bit in the LA airport, made it on our flight. I'm so worried about my bag. We got old. Oh, we're definitely not getting our bags when we get there. Two percent chance our bags break. Two percent. All right, we'll start this video up for real when we get to Sydney. James, we can hit the hill. James, get the damn thing. That's the land. Classic. Of course, James had to break something. Alright folks, we're officially in Australia. Ooh. So guys, it's gonna look like this the entire time we're here. It's gonna look overcast. That is actually smoke because there are some massive forest fires going on right now across Australia. So it's gonna look like that pretty much the whole trip. Yeah okay, guys, so that that's not just overcast, that is smoke overcast. Pretty interesting. All right guys, so on the trip, and also we're shooting on a new camera, a GoPro 8. We went from a seven to an eight. We used a seven, a GoPro seven, all the way since 2018. Made it all the way through 19 with the seven. Did serve as well, and I kept it. But I got an eight, so we're upgraded. Let me know if you like it, or we can go back to the seven. All right, so guys, listen, we have Victor with us. Whatever, what guys? Victor, you guys call him uh, Drake. And quite often, Victor's been around for years. He's also the uh, owner of Bradenton Motorsports Park, where we drag race all the time. And then we have Alan. Many of you guys have met Alan at the events or seen him in videos. He's our business manager, and he's out here with us, helping us organize, divide, and overcome whatever we may be up against. And then we have Mark, my dad. Dad, say hi. What's up? Hi. <laughs> we got my dad out here. He goes by Mark, Marky Mark, and uh, he's just out here enjoying the trip with us. He he's, uh, provides all the snacks for yeah. us. He keeps us fed. He brings yeah. the snacks, takes care of lunch, you know, <laughs> driving. And then this is Jack Stan Jimmy. Yeah, yeah, Jack Stan over here. He's yeah. a mechanic I hired off Craigslist yesterday. And then we have spaghetti sauce up there, old Cooper. So that's the that's the crew. Is this it? <laughs> Imagine, dude, I would love it. Oh, I see it, dude. That's it right there. The white unit up here. Damn, look at this unit. This is us right here. Woo! This is a bad machine. Oh! You look at this wing. Yeah, dude, that's like, what? Probably do 200 with that thing. Yeah. Isn't that the weirdest thing? <laughs> so bizarre. Have you ever driven right head Oh, yeah. Hey, Coop, check your alarm from when you left the shop. See how long we've been traveling for. 24 hours, 24 43 hours. minutes. That's the minute we left the shop to our rental yeah. car. Yep. Wow. We'll see once we get to the hotel. That's crazy. Plus like 45 minutes to our house. So. Hell yeah, we're here, boys. We're in Australia. All right, very weird being on the right side of the car, but no mistakes yet. You're on the wrong side. Yeah, the car. That's not the, the wrong side. side. <laughs> You're on the wrong side and you have to drive on the wrong side. Yeah, dude, it's <laughs> weird. I know. Yeah, we gotta, like, I gotta turn into the left side. So bizarre, dude. We got this. They're wagon holding over there. Wagon holding right here, dude. On see some a, wheels. Gonna see a lot of wagons. Not any V wagons. No, I can guarantee you. No that. CTSB wagons, sadly. Alan, this rental car is just a. It's rowdy. <laughs> <laughs> Neutral. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. James, can you go out there? Can you go out there and drive this thing? I'll go spray some nitrous. <laughs> Big old diesel, it's like blowing black smoke out of the back. Yeah, the <laughs> it's got a flame out of the stack. There's the Alpha House, there's Cooper, Our buddy Pat. They're rolling out here, blowing the way. <laughs> Alright, never mind, that looked bad. <laughs> Sam, Coop. So we're driving near some fires right now, so. In Sydney, we were in Sydney for New Year's, it was awesome. It wasn't horrible. The fires, you know, the smoke there wasn't bad, but now we're on our way to Canberra, and uh, it's definitely getting a lot thicker as far as the, the smoke visibility goes. So, pretty intense. I don't know if it'll clear up as we get closer. We're in a rough spot right now or not, but... It could get worse. It could get worse. It, yeah, they're saying it's gonna get worse. I don't know, it could go either. Yeah. This is uh, pretty intense, but you know what? We're pumped up. 
and you know all the locals they don't mind it at all so we just have to get used to it ourselves and hopefully there's enough tire smoke in the air that we won't be able to see anything. all right guys check it out we have made it to Canberra where the event location is. We got Toast Tune on our Tune laptop that we had to bring with us because we pulled the tune off the computer. So even if someone did get the starter hooked back up and tried to start it, there would be no tune so the car wouldn't run. So we got Toast Tune with us. Otherwise, we're pulling up to the event. I'm so excited. For those of you who weren't around two years ago when we were here, this venue is insane. Hands down the coolest racing or performance venue I've ever even seen. I mean, it's just massive. It's in the capital of Australia, Canberra. It's so sick. And there's places where you can cruise your car around during the event, do burnouts. Then there's obviously the skid pad, which we're gonna go see. But first things first, we're gonna find our boy Toast. We're gonna show you guys the wrap that we came up with. It is so sick, but I've only seen photos and we're really excited to see it because uh, it, just, it was a big effort to get it done because it was supposed to be done in the States, never happened because of the time crunch, but here we are, ready to see it, we're ready to get this thing running today. But we'll be there in a minute, and hell yeah, we'll show you guys around. Snap, there's the first sign, Summer Nats. Dude, oh, there we go, Summer Nats. Summer Nats. Summer Nats. Dude, we are here. Oh, I see car, whoo. Look at this thing coming. Dude, we got rippers yeah, already in yeah. here, dude. Please. I think people are going through uh, scrutineering today. Oi. <coughs> Do a little one for us. Little skid, come on, just just a little spin. A little spin? Yeah, a little. First skid of the trip. Here we go. Hell yeah. There we go. Thank you. He was not hesitant. Dude, I love Australians. You just say, yo, little whip a skid. Heard him whining. They love it, dude. They will just do it. Hey, we know who you are. Oh, hey. What's up? All right, What's guys. Up? This is Adrian. This is our guy in Australia. Our, okay. up, our Australian. Oh. This is the Australian. That's me. Who made this whole thing happen for Toast. So write a comment for Adrian below. I just, mate, I just can't wait for you to see the rap. Oh, it's next level. Is it? Oh, dude. Take us there. We need to go there. You want to go there right Let's now? Let's go there directly. Follow me. <laughs> All right, take a right. Here. My mullet is tingling. Toast must be nearby. My mullet has grown three inches since being an Australian. <laughs> Dude, we grew this mullet for this moment. This is what this has all been for, is this moment right here when we get to see our boy Toast in a different country. Is that a Vegemite sandwich? No. No? Not all Australians eat Vegemite. I can't stand this. Are you sheep. sure? Not really? Oh. Look at that. I got tore up I think for the, saying it was bad. I think the army has to actually cut me out now. All right. Oh, dude, there's our boy. There's our boy. Look at how tall that blower was. <laughs> it's so, yeah. Oh, man, it looks so cool. It's over the roof. Oh, dude, we got to push it out and get a cool thumbnail with this freaking blanket over it. Oh, what is that? Look, there's even a giant Australian bug on it. Wow. It's perfect for this whole situation. It'll kill you. <laughs> It'll kill me. It won't really. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dude. So, All right. It, Dude, I'm a little shook about it. I'm like kind of shaking. I'm so pumped. It was three, three days, three days work from uh, the guys at Vinyl Wraps in Melbourne. They flew up. It was. Well, like, they flew in. It was like 110 degrees in here for three days. It's really hard to wrap cars when it's that hot, and they just. Dude, I can't wait for you to see it. Okay, so and then I also have to say, you know, shout out to Vinyl Wraps. It's mm. at Vinyl Wraps on Instagram, but a huge shout out to. Project Prime because they designed the whole wrap. Oh, the design's ridiculous. And the design came out so good. So it was actually supposed to get wrapped before it left for Australia, but this guy had us in such a rush <laughs> that we didn't get a chance to do it. Not but. sorry. Dude. <laughs> <laughs> do you want to just, do you want to, hold on, hold on. Say when. No, no, we got, <laughs> we're getting scared. I'm getting scared. All right. That's we need one big Australian yank, though. Try to get as much as you can and just see if it all comes You can get some like models for this and stuff. Well, I guess you're pretty good. All right. Wow. <laughs> All right. Wow. Are you ready? Are you ready? All right, brother. Let her rip. <laughs> Let her rip. <laughs> oh, dude, it's so good. All right, so this is the best part. Hold on. You guys are just getting this angle. Bald eagle, American flag on this side. Come over here. Australian flag on the passenger side with a freaking kangaroo. 
We had to do it right, dude. We had to the do it right. Roof too. Oh yeah, the number three, dude. They wrapped the wing in everything. Yeah, they did. They killed it. Wow. Hold on, we gotta push it out. We gotta push it out. I gotta see it up in the. Woo! Everything looks good in here. There we go. Oh my god, dude! I'm so excited. <laughs> see, the good thing about this wrap too is it's gonna break up the wall tap damage because I'm definitely gonna hit the wall. There's just no doubt about that. We've got a surprise for you if you do hit the wall too. Really? We've got some giant Cletus band-aids. Oh, you did? Yeah. Oh, good man. So Don't use them. The plan is, I mean, I know it's going to hit the wall. This is a really long car, and when you guys see how small this burnout pit is, it's just going to happen. The, the rear end or even the front end, it's going to end up in the wall, as you know. Well, you nearly got it last time. I didn't hit it last time, but I got <laughs> close. So, But this is a much larger car, so... Guys, our boy Toast is in Australia. Look at this wrap. It's just too good. It's just too good. Oh my God, dude. It could not possibly be any more perfect. Hell freaking yes. Oh, my. oh, it's all trim so you can take the roof off and stuff? Whew. Okay, guys, so here's the plan. We have to run to the parts store. We have to get lug nuts for our other wheels. We have to get oil for the engine and any other fluids that we need to refill. We gotta get this thing out. We gotta probably, I don't know, will we have to clean the plugs up? We might no, just be able to start it. Fuel, fuel, the tune, the battery hooked up. You got methanol? Dude, they got, they sell methanol here out of the pump. I mean, this is like unreal, so. It will clean up with it running. Wow, the wheels look like oxidized from the trip. Yeah, they're a bit gross. Yeah. I mean, it definitely saw some salt water. Now yeah, we gotta clean some of this stuff up. Wow, you can see the oxidation really, like on the hardware and stuff. Actually, it doesn't look oh. all that bad. Open this. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> yeah, wow. Oil still is. That's perfect. That's how you want it. Yeah. yeah. Still oil in the intake. Dude, still, that's. It's still the stuff we sprayed into yeah. the Yeah. Hell yeah. That's perfect. Bell, everything looks good. So we just got to clean all this stuff up because the uh, salt water just, I mean, I'm sure it, it really, really got pretty it nasty, but, but it's not bad. You know, it could be much worse. So our pins are missing for our hood. But I just think they're out because they're who knows out. we might not need they're this hood. We're gonna... All right, guys, we're gonna go tour the facility right now, and then in a separate video, we'll show everything with uh, firing this thing up. But let's go check out the Summer Nats grounds before we go hit the parts store. This is all too much fun, and <clears throat> definitely feeling the pressure now. You know, I'm gonna have to really kill it on the burnout. We did so much to make this all happen, so we're gonna cover it back up, shove it in the corner, and go get some parts. But there you go, our first ever wrap on this channel. We've never done a vinyl wrap. What do you think, Coop? What's your overall take? I'm a big fan. Big fan? Yeah. I loved the all black, but dude, it's just... Yeah. It had to happen. Like you no, know, it had to. <laughs> it had to happen. It looks really good like this It now. just turned out so good. So that was a... That was pretty exciting, dude. I've been so like... I have a, I don't lose sleep over a lot of the stuff. Kangaroo is like the, sending, perfect, the perfect touch. Yeah, we had to have the half Australian type. But sending a car so far and, you know, just hoping everything comes together. It's so crazy. But to have it all actually have come together... It's we're 80% there. there. Once it runs, we're golden. We're golden. It'll run. It'll look run. At, look at the race lawnmowers. Yeah, oh, they yeah. There, there's the race mowers. Adrian, are these the mowers? Huh? Are these the mowers? Yeah, exactly. Oh, dude. Racing lawnmowers, boys. So, me, Cooper, and James are competing against Australian celebrities on racing lawnmowers. I'm, I'm going to go home and build one now. Dude, you were born I've, for this. I have three mowers I've been building into one. Waiting to build. James is born for this. So guys, the way this event works is in the middle is all the different things going on. And then they have this big road around the whole event that you can just drive around all day. And this road right here is called Tough Street. You actually drive up and down this and do burnouts. And the pedestrians stand on the side. There's barriers. Any time of the day, you can come over here and just rip your car. I've it's like the craziest thing in the world but i love it so much so this year it used to be you could just do the skits right here on the road now you can pull into this side entrance thing that uh you do your skids over there so it's a little bit safer that way all right here we go dude look at how big the grandstands are all right brother this is sick <laughs> it's insane so this is the skid pad guys right here is where you start. See, this is all of the starting marks. You pull up, you park your car right here, your heart is beating a million miles per hour, and uh, once they tell you to go, dude. You just send it. You send it. 
Damn, dude, unreal. Look at how big these barriers are. Them puppies are not moving. Look how, dude, these stands will be packed and then the fence will just be covered with people. And then this entire hill covered with people. Just the loudest Australians you can find. Pretty decent size. Yeah. Coop, look, this has moved over a bunch too. Size pit. Yeah, it's way bigger, it seems like. Healthy size pit. <laughs> so you come in here, you start down there, you come in here, hopefully about 40 or 50 miles an hour, and you just let that baby eat right into here. Dude, how good does this feel? We made it, dude. We are in Australia with a car. This is like stuff dreams are made of. Freaking here, dude. Look at these <laughs> I know. We need what is what is this? We are in a different country with our car. About to do a just a, a skid, a burnout in front of a massive crowd. Like this is like the coolest culture change up, you know, ever because we go to these big drag races, but we don't have these giant, giant scale burnout festivals yet. We're working on our own, but you know, we're getting we're getting there. We're getting cars is coming. We are getting see some frozen cocktails over there too. Oh brother. It's gonna be a Yeah, dude, they have alcohol everywhere at this event and Great. Good time. That's a good time good for those time who aren't driving. <laughs> All right, guys, I'm gonna end it off there. That's it, guys. We're here. We're in Australia. We have toast with us in our possession now. Time to get them running. We're gonna make a whole separate video on that tonight. So we're gonna head to the. Yeah, we gotta go sign some stuff, sign your leases, and then we're going to the parts store. Coming back, we're gonna get it running. Cross fingers everything goes well with that, but thank you guys so much for the support and helping us get all this done and supporting us the whole way, getting toast to Australia. It's been crazy, it's been a journey. One of the coolest journeys we've ever done for sure. We're really excited, but uh, that's it for today. Happy New Year, thanks for watching. Do it for Dale, we'll freaking see you later.